Jerry Pax from GamingShogun.com. We're here at NVIDIA's booth at CES in Las Vegas. I'm here with Adam Straba of NVIDIA. He's going to tell us a little bit about their 3D display technology. It, it's pretty incredible, and uh, well, we're just really happy to see it. How are you doing, Adam? Good. I'm doing well. I'm glad you like it. We're, we're really excited about it. Excellent. Well, so, so just briefly, how does it work overall? How does the system work? Sure. So what we're, what we're doing is we're, um, we're automatically converting uh, any standard DirectX game, any game. We've, we've, we've profiled about 350 titles automatically, right out of the box, old games, new games, into 3D. So, so you'll, be, you'll be playing a game, an old game like Age of Empires, for example, that you've been used to watching on a 2D screen, and now it's like a 3D movie. It's just completely immersive. It's, uh, it's, it's really a great experience. And, and the way we're doing this is we're, uh, we're there's like, there's sort of a, a couple layers to how we're doing this. Um, because we're clearly a graphics card company, and we have drivers, we're, we're going deep into the driver, and we're actually rendering uh, stereoscopic uh, a view. So, so we're actually rendering, instead of one sort of 2D view of, of, of what you're seeing. For example, in Left 4 Dead, as you're walking through the forest, instead of just rendering one view, we're actually rendering a left and right view. So like like when you you know shut your left and right eyes, so stereoscopic. Um, and, and what we're doing is we're, we're, we're throwing that to the display at 120 hertz, left, right, left, right. We're using active shutter glasses, uh, which are, you know, which I'll talk about in a minute, they're actually the, the, the sort of the conduit and, and the, 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 the tool to actually put the left and the, and the right view to the right, to the appropriate eye. So essentially what, what you do is with, with this product, you, you, you buy the stereoscopic, this G, GeForce 3D Vision kit, you put it on, so we, we've got a glasses, they're, they're fairly stylish, they as, as you can stylish. see, thank you, thank you. Um, they're, they're, they're wireless, they're, they're uh, rechargeable, two hours of, of charge, uh, charging them is, is about 40 hours of continuous gaming, so that's, that's long battery life. Uh, built to, to fit over uh, glasses, um, they're pretty resilient, they're high quality optics. So basically what you do is, with the 3D Vision kit, with the glasses, you've got a stereoscopic uh, driver, you, uh, you also need, so, so basically you, you install a stereoscopic driver, you've got the glasses, and, and with, with 120 hertz display, the 120 hertz display is kind of key, um, we're actually throwing, we're actually uh, throwing to the display 120 hertz, 120 frames a second. What kind of uh, bundle kits are, is NVIDIA going to be selling here? Sure, sure. So I, I, it's, it's up, really up to the retailers, but there's going to be probably a number of common kits uh, that are, or common bundles that are available. Clearly, you're going to be able to buy these individually as kits, right. uh, just the glasses, the glasses kit. Um, like the, probably the most common bundle will be glasses and a monitor. So a lot of our a lot of our customers probably already have a GeForce, and this actually works for any GeForce card. You don't need a special card. Really, any any any, any, any GeForce card really. But we're, we know we generally recommend something middle of the other line. So say yeah. that 8800 GT or 96. Or GT and above. Right. That's really all you need. Um, also, probably a common bundle will be maybe an upgrade of, of, a, of a graphics card as well. So display, uh, 3D vision kit, and, and a graphics card. That's great. And uh, if you're just going to buy these glasses by themselves, what, what about is the MSRP on the glasses? Sure. So we're, we're beginning the detail price is $199. $199. Okay. Yeah. And um, when you're rendering uh, basically a left and a right image, what kind of a performance decrease have you guys seen, if any, from the Sure. Concert? So one of the, one, of the, one of the key things about this technology is probably a couple of key things that I didn't mention. Uh, the fact that, that unlike other un other solutions, this is actually full resolution, full refresh rate. Uh, the, the, th the biggest, probably one of the key uh, features is the fact that they're, because we're doing the, all the rendering at the deepest level in the driver, uh, it's the, we're, we're really doing a very efficient uh, representation of left and right. So actually there's, there's very little performance hit. Uh, other, other, because we're actually doing twice the work, right? We're actually rendering left and a right view, right. Uh, which you'd think you'd actually require twice the performance to get the same level of, of gaming uh, that, that you would before. We're actually seeing roughly something maybe up to maybe 20% performance hit. So I mean, really, when it comes down to it, it's kind of in the noise. It's not it really, it's not really a performance hit at all. Thank you, Adam. We really appreciate it. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you very much. Jerry Paxton for GamingShogun.com.